Lawrence. He's been an incredibly successful man on television and medicine. He knows what's happening, and he's going to work and fight for Pennsylvania. Thank you. Pennsylvania, we have one question, one important question we have to answer by November 8th. Are you ready for it? Is the country headed in the right direction? And if you don't mind, I'd like to have Dr. Oz come up and say a few words. Do we love President Trump, Pennsylvania? Has Joe Biden made us miss him even more? The only thing Joe Biden has built back better is the Republican Party. That President Trump leads, he sees the shining city on the hill. He sees it here in the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. He's fighting to save it. But he's fighting for more. This could be the vote that's going to make the difference between a country and not a country, because I, it could be 51, it could be 50, it could be 49. And if it's 49 for the Republicans, this country, I don't know if it's going to live for another two years. That's what's happening. So you got to get out and vote for this man. He's a good man. He's a good man. And tell them that I will bring change to Washington so they treat us the way we deserve. You all in? We'll win. God bless you. I have a continuous struggle trying to figure out why Washington keeps getting it wrong. How many of you think Washington's getting it wrong? And I finally think I might have a diagnosis. Washington's getting it wrong because of the extreme positions that they're accepting of. And they need a dose of Pennsylvania reality. I want to go to Washington and bring balance. So you actually have the partisan bickering fall away and we address the problems that are plaguing people in Pennsylvania and all around this beautiful country. And I want to thank some other individuals who are in actually unbelievably close friends, made a big difference in my life, are always there at every moment. Let's start with 45, President Trump. <laughs> President Trump, we look to America and we wonder, my goodness, if they figured it out, we can figure it out. My friends, we are a role model to the world. And God bless you, sir, for putting so much effort into this race. I will make you proud. Whoa. God bless you. Take care, my friends. If your health is as strong as it seems from your review of systems, why not share your medical records? Why not? Well, I have really no problem in doing it. I, I have it right here. I mean, I, should I do it? I don't care. Should I do it? Yeah. It's, uh, 
It's two letters. One is the report, and the other is from Lenox Hill Hospital. May, may I see them? Saying, yeah, sure. So these are the these are the report. This those, is from. Those were all the tests that were just done. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome conservative outsider and U.S. Senate candidate for the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania, Dr. Mehmet Oz. Yeah.